He's yeah. charging in front of that 24 teammate. He is. Top of the board, 49, 708. Wow. Nine one hundreds faster than his teammate, William Byron. That's a big pickup. Almost two tenths of a pickup. Run of 87 to a 70. So I'm thinking this Rick Hendrick just likes being on the front row. He doesn't have to. He don't want to walk to those cars come Sunday. He just wants to be right up front. And the crazy thing, watching him through turns one and two, he was way higher than the other drivers were, and he is mowing down the back stretch. I mean, carried a ton of momentum. He's way faster. That's yes, what he, he is. is. Way faster. Incredible to come. Again, Blake Harris, different crew chief even. To be able to take two crew chiefs of the same car, same driver, and have the same result, unbelievable. Front row bow, amazing Alex. The record is solely his six consecutive Daytona 500 front row starts. Josh. Yeah, new crew chief, same result. You break your own record six years in a row on the front row and on the pole for the Daytona 500. How do you now transfer this over to a win in the 500? Yeah, that's the trick, right? We've obviously not been able to do that for the last five years. So just trying to make the right decisions and um, the, transfer everything over to, to race trim for Sunday the best we can. So just so proud of Hendrick Motorsports, the engine shop, all the guys. Um, this Ally 48 Camaro is obviously really fast. I don't have a lot to do with qualifying here. so. Just fortunate to uh, qualify some really fast race cars and uh, really cool to see Hendrick Motorsports 1, 2, 3. So, um, yeah, petition to make uh, Blake do the five hours of media tomorrow for the poll award, but um, <laughs> I'll, I'll take it. It's pretty cool. Hey, race fans, thanks for watching our video. For all NASCAR on Fox News content and the best clips from Fox Sports, be sure to follow and subscribe to our channel.